The Blackhawks prospect has now gone public after two team executives were forced out over their handling of his accusations of sexual assault. Kyle Beach was a first round pick in 2008. He gave an emotional first interview and says he now feels vindicated. Eric Rung is live at the United Center with more. Good morning, Eric. Good morning to you. Beach gave that interview to a Canadian television station and it came just a day after the results of a damning independent investigation were made public. He needed to go to a team. That when Kyle Beach was drafted by the Blackhawks in 2008, he was on his way to fulfilling his NHL dream, first with the Hawks minor league teams, but during his junior season. In 2010, he was recalled to the Blackhawks as a black ace. The Blackhawks would go on to win the Stanley Cup that year. Unfortunately, uh, a couple weeks after, um, those memories were, were tainted. Uh, and my life was changed forever. Beach says he was sexually assaulted by team video coach Bradley Aldrich. The then 20 year old says he brought the allegations to Blackhawks management, but nothing was done. To be honest, I, I was scared mostly. I was fearful. I had had my career threatened. I felt alone. He was told the allegations made it all the way to the top of the organization, but still with the team on the verge of winning the cup, he heard nothing. Years passed, but learning Aldrich's name was tied in with another sexual assault, this time of a teen in Michigan, he knew he had to do something. Because of what happened to him, it gave me the power and the sense of urgency to take action. <laughs> to make sure it wouldn't happen to anybody else. Beach would file a lawsuit, which would lead to an independent investigation. The results of that investigation were released earlier this week and said top executives failed to act on the information provided by Beach. Following the release, GM Stan Bowman and senior VP of Hockey Operations Al McIsaac are now no longer with the team. Just a, a great feeling of relief, vindication, and it was no longer my word against everybody else's. Beach is now playing hockey in Germany. Aldrich was convicted of that sex crime against the teenager in Michigan back in 2014. He is now a registered sex offender. We're live at the UC. I'm Eric Rung, WGN News.